Hi, I'm Ellie. I'm from Australia and you're watching Fun for Louie. Right, we've come out for a late breakfast. We've got some yogurts again, got our coffees. Cheers, man. <laughs> Cheers, bro. We've gone for a little stroll. We're now chilling in another coffee shop. Look how nice this duck is. This is a really nice duck. This person looks really important. I don't know who it is. Can anyone tell me who it is? I haven't got a clue. Damo, what just happened, man? I forgot to put money in the parking meter. I got a ticket. Oh, you won a prize? Yeah, I won, I won something. You won a prize? I won $44. Oh. Yeah. Mm. I uh, no, but bro, that says penalty, man. I think that no, means, it doesn't. Yeah, I don't think you want it. That says pride. No. I think you have to pay that. No, I don't. I'm not going to pay it. <laughs> well, it's a really sunny day today. It rains held up for my last day in Cairns. I haven't told you guys, but I'm actually flying back down to Sydney tomorrow. And uh, I'm, we're just on our way to see Louis. He's going to neaten up my dreads again before I continue on my travels. All right, we've come back to uh, hang out with Louis. He's going to sort these out. And uh, I'm going to show you a little bit more like how he's actually doing it. You just kind of pick it up, kind of wrap it around, and then you kind of pushing the hook through and grabbing these hairs on the on the other side and pulling them inside. And then as you pull the hook out, you should be curving the hook so it kind of lets go of the hair rather than yeah. rips it out. See you later, Louis. Thanks for sorting my dreads out. Well, my dreads are looking pretty neat. Louis always does a good job. I need to learn that um, crochet technique. Uh, we're coming back into town and uh, we're just stopping up for a little feed tonight with everyone. We're having a little farewell meal over at uh, Mari's house, I think. Shopping done. Right, we've just got here and we're getting some food together. We're doing some salami rolling. Mm. We've just come outside because Bridget told me she got attacked by a massive spider while she was driving. And we're going to see if we can find it. It might still be by the car. What happened? What happened, Bridget? Okay, so I was driving along and um, a spider jumped on here and I saw it. I was at stoplight and I saw it and I wound up that window and he crawled across, across here while I was How driving. How big was it? Oh, like this big. <laughs> Whoa. He was crawling and then he came to this side. My uh, and side. then you don't know where he went? And yeah, well, he just kept going like up and down the side of the car. And I couldn't see him after that, so I'm, I'm hoping he doesn't Is get it? inside the car and, and go inside. He might be in here somewhere. Well guys, to 
today's been really chilled and um, I've actually been sad today. Um, today's my last day and I've grown to love a lot of people here over the last two weeks and I'm sad to go. Um, but I am going to be going down to Sydney tomorrow and then on to New Zealand for a week. I'm going to be travelling all around the North Island and uh, getting up to a whole bunch of adventures. So uh, keep watching. Things are going to get a bit more exciting. It's been pretty chilled the last couple of days. Um, yeah, I've got an early start tomorrow and I'll see you then. Peace out, enjoy life and live the adventure. Boom.